In this problem, we're given a sequence, and we have to show that it satisfies this recurrence relation. Let's go ahead and work through this. So, solution. So, all we have to do is just take this and plug it into this and make sure that it's true. Now, typically, it's better to start uh, by writing down the more complicated side, which in this case is the right-hand side. So, for k greater than or equal to 1, we're going to look at 2 times c sub k minus 1 plus 1. And so now what we'll do is we'll actually plug this in. We'll plug in c sub n into our expression here. So this is 2. So c sub n is 2 to the n minus 1. So here it'll be 2 to the k minus 1 minus 1, right? Just replacing all of the n's here with k minus 1's. And then we still have the plus 1. Okay, so this is equal to 2 times 2 to the k minus 1 minus 2 plus 1. Now, uh, 2 is really 2 to the 1, and so when you multiply 2 to the 1 times 2 to the k minus 1, you end up adding the exponents, so you get 2 to the k, and then minus 2 plus 1 gives us minus 1. And this is actually our sequence. If you look back up here, it's 2 to the n minus 1, so this is actually just c sub k, which is 2 to the k minus 1. So we've shown that they are both equal. So we've shown that 2, to this, two times c sub k minus 1 plus 1 is equal to c sub k. So we've shown our sequence satisfies this recurrence relation.